I'm on my WR 250R today, baby. I know some of you guys like cycle cruising. When you go ride the WR, ah, ah, and I'm riding out here in the hood at night, which I don't recommend doing, definitely. But anyways, five Harley Davidson mods that are absolutely horrible. Let's go for a ride. <laughs> watching cycle cruises all on one motorcycle channel subscribe today continually video suggestions but you may find what you're looking for by visiting my website at cyclecruiser.com and click on the menu tab my videos and those are a bunch of playlists with all of my videos categorized in them to make it easier for you to navigate through i know you guys are gonna say uh look at you riding that little 250 you need to get a real man's bike a harley davidson only real men ride harleys <laughs> Well, you know what? I love my WI 250i. Let's go for a ride. But anyways, the number one horrible, absolutely ridiculous mod has to be the ape hangers. Those big, especially the big tall ones like up here. Those are the, that is the dumbest mod that I think I've ever seen on a motorcycle. I've never, some of you guys just think that's cool. That is not cool, man. Lose all kind of performance on that bike. I mean, how do you? <laughs> I know, it's like, I never understood why those were so cool. That's like the the lamest mod. I don't know, man. But I know some of you guys. It's all with, with Harley. It's all about looking cool. Got the arms up here. Look at that. Looking like an ape. <laughs> looking like a fool. Ape fool, like I should say, up here on the streets. That's just ridiculous, man. Now, maybe the smaller ape hangers down here. All right, we'll give you a pass on that, man. I'm not totally hating. But these up here, come on, man. Come on, serious. I saw a dude in this town not a uh, couple of months ago riding with a bike that had. I was like, this dude, he thought he looked so cool. He had the shades on. Like, yeah, yeah. And of course, he didn't wave to me because you know, Harley Davidson riders, they don't like to wave except for the other Harley Davidson riders. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. You got some good Harley. I'm not a Harley Davidson hater. I know a lot of you guys think I am. I'm not. I think they make beautiful bikes. My main gripe with Harley Davidson is that the prices are way too expensive, man. What, what, a ballpark figure? What are these run about? What, 20, 18, 20, 25? Range, yeah. Uh -huh. 20, somewhere in that range. But anyways, number two, ridiculous mod, absolutely ridiculous, is tassels coming out of the grip, like on a grip or something. That, that man, I can't believe grown ass men, big old, supposed to be tough and macho out here on the Harleys and got tassels. We got, we got dudes out here in 2019 with tassels hanging from their Harleys. <laughs> what the hell? I can't believe that. Oh my goodness, man. That is. We did that when I was like a kid on big wheels. We had tassels coming out, man. But yet we got these big macho guys out here with some tassels on their Harley Davidsons. That is the lamest mod ever. That's, that's got actually. That should be number one. But those ape hangers are just ridiculous, man. <laughs> But anyways, number three, which I mentioned in another video, is vinyl wrap. I can't believe guys will put on a $20,000 plus dollar motorcycle, they would put vinyl wrap. <laughs> vinyl wrap their bike. That is just so lame, man. I just think vinyl wrap is so cheesy. I didn't get a lot of hate. A lot of you guys cycle cruises. Shut up, man. You're talking out of your ass again. Uh, vinyl wrap is awesome. It's amazing. I have it on my bike. Okay, it's cool. Okay, maybe a sport bike. I don't like it on. I think it's cheesy on a sport bike. But sport bike, okay, but a Harley Davidson vinyl wrap? Really? <laughs> oh, but anyways, number four, spoke wraps. I mentioned that in another video. I can't believe. I now. People do that to, you know, dirt bikes. They put the spoke wraps on.
But on Harley Davidson's, a twenty thousand plus dollar bike, you put spoke wraps on there, like straws, colored straws on there. <laughs> I mean, come on, man. I think it was corn. I did that mod on my on this WR two fifty R. I think it is cheesy, but you got to get your spokes properly powder coated. You know black like i did my wr 250r that's the only way to do it man and for on a twenty thousand plus dollar harley davidson have the audacity to put spoke wraps <laughs> that's a horrible mod but anyways number five which i think is ridiculous that a lot of you guys do is you put skulls all over your bike what's up with that it's like, do you want to die? I mean, why are you representing death on your motorcycle? Now, I know I'm going to get a lot of hate on that because like that skulls are cool, man. You know what I'm saying? It's badass with skulls. It's, you shut up, Cycle Cruiser. You're talking out of your butt again, man. You're talking out of your butt, dude. Skulls are cool. You're not cool. You're not cool enough to be on a Harley Davidson. And you probably can't afford one. That's why you're not on a Harley, dude. You're just not cool enough for one. You gotta have skulls on them. You gotta put tassels on them, dude. You gotta put ape hangers on them. Those are the cool riders, dude. You're just not cool enough. <laughs> whatever, dude. All I gotta say is whatever makes you happy. That's all that matters. It doesn't matter what Psycho Cruiser thinks, but I'm just joking about it and having fun with it. And we'll keep doing it too, baby. Ha <laughs> ha! Because I'm on my WR 250. Ah, oh, baby! Having a good old time out here in the hood. <laughs> but, anyways, guys, I'm just messing around with it. I think they are ridiculous, cheesy, and horrible, but hey, that's just my opinion. You guys think a lot of stuff that I do. I've been called the king of cheesy mods, to be honest with you, because I've done a lot of cheesy stuff myself, man. So I'm not just total hating, guys. I'm just messing, having fun with it, whatever. I just want you guys to get out there and ride. And I'm freezing my butt off out here because I love riding. But anyway, for those of you guys who want to get my gear, you know these heated gloves that keep my hands warm, my boots, gloves, camel pants, all my stuff. I always include links in the description and comment section of my videos or go to my website, psychocruiser.com and click on the menu tab, my gear, and that's links to all my stuff. Thumbs up, check out my playlist for new riders and popular videos. Don't forget to comment and subscribe and check out my other channel, Bug Out Moto, where I customize a van for my motorcycle so I can live in my van with my motorcycle and travel across the country anywhere. Subscribe to my YouTube channel, Bug Out Moto.